Vietnam, the new settlement was established only five weeks ago. We took this place and we make it to be a flourishing and living community. We have here today 52 families that came from all over Israel to live here. And we have another 70 families They are in a waiting list. They want to come and take part in this incredible community. We have here a Bet Midrash. We have parks and kindergarten for the kids. A Midrashah for women to come and learn. We paved roads, we brought infrastructure of water and electrical system. The pioneering spirit that enables building such a beautiful community as Aviatar is a direct continuation of the spirit of Gush Emuni movement that established so many communities all over Yehuda and Shomron. Aviatar opens the gate for many more Jewish communities to build all over Yehuda and Shomron. Aviatar was established in memory of Aviatar Borovsky and Yehuda Gueta, who were both murdered not far from here in Tapuach Junction. Right after the murder of Yehuda, we came here, Nahala Movement, together with the Regional Council of Samaria, with the decision to make it big, strong, and to stay here forever. We are living here a normal life, like every family. I take the children to their schools and kindergartens. I work in my office of my bookkeeping business. 20 years, no settlement was established in Yudav Shomron. Finally, after all these years, thousands of people are coming here, and buses, and vehicles, private vehicles, all kinds of Israeli citizens, proud Jews, are coming here to Evyatar and taking part of building this amazing settlement. My name is Bacheva. We came uh, here from Lod. We came to support Aviatar. My husband and I grew up in the Golan. When we heard about Aviatar, we took our seven children and came to Aviatar. Aviatar is located between Tapuach and Migdalim, in the heart of the Shomron. The land that we're sitting on is not private Palestinian land. Now, the Shomron Regional Council submitted plans to all the authorities in a short time, we did and we achieved a lot, but there is still much more work to do. It's critical, especially in our days, to make sure that Aviatar will continue to develop. We need to build more houses, to bring more families, to improve the infrastructure. We need to make sure that Aviatar will continue to grow and develop. There is a unique opportunity to each and every one of us to take part in this important Zionist mission. Join us. Together, we will create history.